Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome for Mighty Reptiles here. Here's my dad. Hi. And today we're going to be doing something a little bit different. As you can see down here, we have a pile of babies um, because we've been so busy hatching out clutches, we haven't been able to do the follow-ups for you guys. So what we're going to be doing now is something that's a little bit different. They're already in their bin, so we're going to be giving you guys the results and sexes of what we actually got out of it. Um, and be showing them to you guys. So first off we have here is obviously the Exantic clutch. So I'm gonna go ahead and save the Exantics for last, but let's go ahead and get into this. So first off, I'm gonna start off with this little normal. Very, very pretty. Um, just regular normal, no jeans, but it is 100% for Exantic. And these are also 50%, every single baby is 50% het for um, snow. So they're 100% head exanthic and 50% chance for albino. And this here is a little female, normal, 100% head exanthic, 50% head albino. Now, that was a female you said? This is a female. We already have it spoken. We have a, one of our subs already wants that. It's up here. Oh, I see it, yeah. yeah. So, so there you go. There you go. And. Next, I'm gonna go with the, Here, taking off. the other normal. Another normal. This one's got a lot of blushing on the back. I really like the pattern on this one. And it's even yep. got a little bit more flushed out sides. Let's go ahead and see what gender you are, little one. So what we have here is a male, as you can tell by those two hemipenes. Mm -hmm. 100% head exanthic and 50% head for snow. So the male um, is still available. The female is going to be sold, or at least that's the, the plan right now. Yeah. If that changes, we'll let you know. But two normal head exanthics. Now we move on to the spider. Yeah, this spider was running away, so I grabbed it. The pastel head exanthic, take a shot of those. It's starting to <laughs> actually crawl up your shirt. <laughs> <laughs> so. Can you hold it more over so I don't have to? Yeah. I can yeah. get a better over the top view. Very pretty, got a very strong gold line down the back. But very, very pretty little spider here. Look at the little weirdness on the head stamp there in the middle. Make it on the... Really bold lines here in the front. Let me see Oops. if the other spider's like that. The other spider is really bold too. Where are you going? Whereas if we look here at the Exantic spider, see how the eyebrow type stuff here is actually thinner than here. That's what's different about these two. Really cool head stamp. Yeah, I can't see it on the camera. All right, so now we're gonna find out the gender. It is a male, 100% head exanthic and 50% head for albino. Yeah, yeah. there you go. Can you get that head stamp now? There we go. Yeah, it's right. very, very pretty. Got it. Okay, so that's one spider, head exanthic, 50% head albino. Yeah. That is a male. Herding cats. Oh, I didn't realize we even had another normal here, but here's. Oh, Mr. Normal. Another <laughs> normal? Let me get this one back over here. Yeah, another normal. This one has a lot of blushed outsides. Not as much on the top as the other one did, but it does have some blushing to it. Let's go ahead and figure out its gender. Stay over. Try it. And it is a male. Okay, so two males. Two male normals that are 100% het for Exantic, 50% for Albino. And next, let's go on to the next spider. Give you guys a good look what it looks like. Very, very pretty. A very bold head pattern there. Let's go ahead and figure out what sex it is. It is a male as well. So we have um, 2.1 normals, 100% head for exanthic, 50% for albino, and 2.0 spiders. We're, we're striking out here. <laughs> yeah, on the sex hey, guys. You, you look like you want to eat. So. Next up is this very pretty, just exanthic. No right. spider or pastel on this one. And this one is spoken for as well. Mm 
All right, and it is a little girl. That's good. I was gonna clarify and say, if it's a girl it's spoken for, and it's a girl, so. Uh, we knew that they wanted an azanthic and they preferred a female. All right, so next up I'm gonna go to the spider. This is one that we thought was a zebra bee, but I, we, we believe that it was it's, possible. Yeah. yeah, we're siding with it being a spider. And let's go ahead and see if this is a female, we're keeping it. Um, but if it is a male, it will be for sale. And that will be two times in a row that we get what we're aiming for. And we have to sell it because of genders. I thought we were selling this one. And this is a little girl. A little girl, cool. So there you go, we'll finally have our own visual exantic female. <laughs> These guys are just running. All right, so now we're on to our very last baby from this clutch, and it is that gorgeous, gorgeous pastel now, exantic. Hold still, let me see if I can get, no, hold still. <laughs> say that as I don't move. <laughs> yeah, hold still and then he moves. Beautiful. Just very pretty guy here. And then here, let's see if we can actually, there you go. Yeah. Get in a little tighter on him. Okay, and then hold still. We can't get the camera actually physically close to it because of the huge microphone. So it creates a huge shadow. Yeah, Beauty. very pretty. Look at those white sides. Just so pretty. Very pretty. Let's go ahead and figure out what their gender is. This one is a male. Ah! Not exactly what we wanted, but... Yeah, so that pretty, one will be available. Yeah, definitely. Pretty nonetheless. So that is a male pastel exanthic, and he is 50% het for snow. So yeah, really cool. So and we were four and three on that, right? I think so. Yeah. Um, yeah, the exan two of the exanthics were... No. Female. Normal is a female. One of the normals. One normal, two of the exantics. And then the just the exantic visual. Yes, and the spider. And the spider. So that yeah. That one's gone. It's just out of here. <laughs> so yeah. Um, one thing that we're going to be doing a little bit differently on this one is actually we're going to be doing two clutches rather than one follow-up. So let's go ahead and get to the next clutch that we are going to be following up. All right, so here is the next clutch that is really exciting that everybody seemed to enjoy. Um, this one we did not actually get footage on for the channel, unfortunately, um, but we did announce this on the live stream when we did cut it because um, our footage got corrupt and then we just lost all the footage and you can't recut really eggs. So it just kind of sucks. So. If you aren't paying attention to the live streams, make sure you do. We even did a live cutting in the most recent one. So here is the results from our yellow belly by our blackhead gravel 50% het pied. And I'm gonna start off with this first one here. This is a yellow belly slash gravel baby. And I'm gonna go ahead and get you guys the sex on it. It is a little male. So the yellow belly is a male. And two of the blackheads are out of here. Yeah. Probably can't even see them. So we did luck out in this case. We got three that are blackhead gravel slash yellow belts. Right. Um, once again, we can't distinguish them between gravel and yellow belly. There's nobody who can. Right. And if, they, if somebody can, please tell us. Because that would be great. There are people who say they can until they're pushed to it. Yeah. <laughs> so. Here is a blackhead gravel slash yellow belly. Very pretty, love the sides on them. And let's go ahead. Oh, this has a yellow belly just like his dad. See the yellow going down mm -hmm. the middle, how he has the yellow markers? Yeah, very That's much It's really so. cool. Let's go ahead and see. Let me do that one again. This is a little girl, cool. blackhead. Gravel slash yellow belly. Little girl, so we may be keeping that one. We'll see, there's three. And next up we have this one, which has a little bit more orange and is typically a little bit brighter in the sides. Very pretty, blackhead slash gravel. Blackhead, gravel slash yellow belly. There we go, correcting myself. So the pairing on this one was a blackhead gravel 50% het pied paired to a yellow belly. The dad is not proven het pied yet, so these do have 
the possibility of being 50% het pied themselves if he does prove eventually. And this is another little girl. Excellent. So black head gravel slash elderly. Look at that spot of blushing here. Do you see that? Right below her head. Look at look at how flushed out that is. I can't see. Alright. Now let's just get on to the final two, which are all running away. So I know you guys are all waiting for this highway. But for the last blackhead gravel uh blackhead gravel slash shell belly is actually my personal favorite out of them. Look at how orange the blushing is and it goes up really high. Like look at right here. Do you see that? Yeah, just how really orange. Really pretty. Nice flames on it. <laughs> and, well, and they're all trying to be held. They're going for my hands. <laughs> all right. Well, let's figure out. Food. And this is a little boy. <laughs> oh no. It's all right. We've got two other ones. So this one will be for sale because we do already have the dad and this is an exact copy of it. But yeah. Very, very pretty blackhead slash gravel male. Last one. Right after I round them all up again. Let's see if I can. Come on, ball python for me. It's holding on. All right. So here's the final one. It is the highway. Just very, very pretty. So if this is a female, we are keeping it for sure. But. If it is a male, it is going to be sold. Stop talking with your hands. <laughs> You're holding the snake. And it is also a male. So here it is. Little male highway that will be available. Very, very pretty. Look at is that. that still? Yeah, it is pretty. Absolutely so light. So yeah. Okay. Highway mail. So yeah. Um, so we hope you guys enjoyed this little different version here um, of the follow-ups. We're going to be giving you guys two of these at a time. So um, we do have three clutches in the incubator right now that are already cut. One of which still has all the babies crawling out. Our next cutting is on the 18th of August. Um, so we're going to be going to the super super show this weekend before then so we're not gonna have you know a new cutting heading into the show right um, but if you do see us there make sure to stop by and say hello um, if you are going to be there on both days I specifically ask that you stop me on Saturday because um, I'm going to be there with the coal on Sunday and in which case if you're just gonna be there on Sunday want to say hi um, please do that but if you can choose in between which day please do Saturday um, you yeah. can't really pick you yeah it's just it, it bothers here when i'm just like being pulled to the side I understand, uh, I understand so yeah other than that we hope you guys enjoyed if you did make sure to hit the like button subscribe if you haven't already um hit the notification bell because we are going to be doing a giveaway in less than 600 subscribers That's right. and that is fine we it seems like we just did the giveaway drawing like you know like two weeks ago yeah we're still trying to give it away <laughs> <laughs> So yeah, um, other than that guys, we hope you guys enjoyed and as always, we will see you guys in the next one. See ya.